Michael Diamond, you're watching Muscle Central. Okay, it appears as though Josh Donardowitz is planning on stepping on a competitive stage again. Remember a number of years back when he first really burst onto the scene? It was a third place finish in the Honor Classic. I can't remember what year it was, but he placed third behind Cedric McMillan and Ty Green. Very impressive and looked to have a promising uh, career. Unfortunately, he's had a few setbacks along the way. Things have happened that have derailed him. One was when Dallas McCarver passed away. Josh Lenardowitz was living in the States with, uh, with Dallas and comes home one night and finds him dead on the kitchen floor. Uh, I can't even imagine what that would do to somebody's uh, mindset, but he had stopped competing after that. And uh, he made it come back, uh, did a few shows, and then he had some uh, uh, health issues. I think there was an there was an injury that, if I remember correct, there was also an injury that set him back again. Then it was health issues. He had to have uh, a brain surgery. Uh, not uh, wasn't cancer or anything. There was something. Uh, I'm sorry, it might not. Actually, it would have been the brain. It could have been the inside of the skull, which is uh, uh, encasing the brain of some sort of growth. Like I said, not cancerous. From what I understand, uh, he's not the only one in his family who's had this. Wasn't So it wasn't... And necessarily life life threatening thing, but something that needed to be addressed, which could cause problems. And it appeared as though he wouldn't be competing anymore. And once again, uh, it looks like he's in a be back in the training mode, step on a stage again. Uh, it's unfortunate. I mean, I, I like, I've always liked jo jo Josh Lenardowitz. He seems to be, kind of reminds me of, of Victor Martinez. And there was so much potential with him. Second place in Mr. Olympia, arguably could have won the show, but he had so many, so much shit going on. One thing after the next, I kept on derailing him and never really got to maximize his potential. Great guy, great bodybuilder, just shit didn't go right for him. He just one little mishap after the next, and seems to be happy, seems to uh, somewhat be the same story with Josh Lenardowitz. He's not a youngster either. Uh, in the last was it five years or so, four or five years, he hasn't competed much at all. Uh, he, he's 38 years old and he's had some shit going on. Uh, personally, I would say 
really reconsider your options and decide whether this really is the right thing and the best thing for you to do. Uh, if you are going on and go forward with this comeback, I wish you the best. On a personal level, uh, I don't think it's going to turn out uh, quite the way you would want it to. Any, anyway, either way, best of luck, Josh Lenardowitz. Uh, no uh, date show when he'll be stepping on stage again, but it seems as though he got the contest uh, mode back in him. Okay, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please share and by all means subscribe. Do not forget to hit that notification bell. This way, every time I put up a new video, you will be notified. Also, if you go to the description box, you're going to find some links there. One link is to the Facebook Muscle Central page. Any questions, you can go there, DM me. I'd be happy to answer. I'm also going to find links to Species Nutrition, Mr. Potts Protein. Click on both links, go to both websites. Check out all their great products. Once again, this is Michael Diamond, and I'd like to thank you for watching Muscle Central.